Pirate Cake by Cornell and Deal. What's up everybody, Eric here from TN Tobacco. Today I'm gonna to be looking at this very popular, very Latakia heavy blend from Cornell and Deal. So let's get to it. So this is a very popular blend, especially amongst Latakia lovers because it is 75% Latakia. So right off the bat, that should give you an idea of what it's going to be like. I have some uh, in a jar here. The scent is really heavy campfire smoke, touch of barbecue, a slight sweet apricot type note. It's just a, it's just a really nice tobacco. Uh, the presentation is a, it's a, a crumble cake. Uh, prior to being pressed into the crumble cake, it's pretty much a cross-cut tobacco. This is a one-pound block. Um, so as you can see, I do like it a lot because I do buy it <laughs> by the one-pound block. Um, but yeah, it's pretty much a granulated tobacco prior to being pressed into cakes. So it does pack very easy. It's not like big, long ribbons or anything. Uh, moisture level coming out of the package is pretty much perfect. Uh, it's it's relatively dry. It's not super moist anyways, so there it goes. Um, all right, let me get this lit up and we'll get to seeing how it tastes. So just starting off here, nice smokiness, obviously, because it is a major lap bomb. Get a decent chocolatey note. The apricotty sweetness does come through from the from the tin note as well. And then the finish goes into kind of a sweet coffee with that just that kind of smoke just kind of lingers through only like a creosote smoke. All right, I'll get smoking this down and see if anything else pops out. Today I am smoking my GDB. This, uh, I'm not even sure when it's from. It's probably somewhere from the 80s. Uh, I got this with a Peterson and a Camoys uh, at the same time for a whopping $28. Um, one of the first estate pipes I ever bought. So I'm about a quarter of the way in here and now it's kind of settled in. It's just a nice pine smoke with those touch of cocoa coffee notes. It's kind of a tingly sensation, kind of like a prickly sensation on the palate. Retrohale, you get a little touch of that fruit and sweetness. And then the finish just kind of dies into a pine, almost like a more of a pine board than a, a pine wood, more than a pine needle type of, type of flavor. So I'll keep smoking this down and let you know if anything else changes. How of the day today? Today I'm wearing a Dockers flat cap with ear flaps. Um, it's actually a really nice hat. I didn't even know Dockers made hats when I first got it. Um, you should check it out. All right, so I've pretty much smoked this down to nothing. Going farther into the bowl, it really develops a nice sweetness on the finish. Basically, after every puff, get, it just degrades into a nice sugar cane sweetness. You have that nice smokiness in there, too. Slight touches of coffee in there as well. And then you have that pine board type of flavor as well. So that's pretty much it. Um, moisture, pretty much none in the bowl, so that's always good to burn down to nothing. So there you go, that has been Cornell and Deal's Pirate Cake. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, comments, suggestions, questions down below. There's also a Discord channel that I've opened up that you can find in the description, and I'll see you next time on Tea and Tobacco. See you guys.